we have recovered much silver than gold here because our West Solution contains silver from our silver recovery. Maybe this is all 10% gold. And this is a black precipitation on my West bucket here. And this is our West bucket that I have already a precipitate copper just like this by adding iron pipe as you can see here the copper precipitation this bucket is almost done reaction and this one is already done and if you want to know how to dispose this west and visit some of my video after capturing our copper inside the bottom of our bucket then we add a sodium hydroxide to precipitate iron we add sodium carbonate to neutralize the acid then ready for storage for one year so what we are going to do now is to recover gold from this material this one also so let's proceed after multiple rinses with water then I add to our fire charcoal here with stainless steel at the bottom to burn the filter and some evaporate excess chemical here so let's allow a few minutes This is exactly what we are looking for. All the filter are burned and also our material here. After burning, this is exactly look like dust. So we add now to our beaker then we cover distilled water here just like that then we add 36% it's ill 50-50 ratio just like that then soak it or leave it at least a 12 hours the reason here is to dissolve excess chemical here and other soluble with HCl after soaking with hydrochloric acid 12 hours ago as you can see our solution is for green and there's so many particles settle down so we decant this one after decantation this is our solution that I discard then we pour hot distilled water here the reason here is to remove hydrochloric acid hydrochloric acid is soluble with water easily then allow to settle down
when the tiny particle has settled down then decant the water then do it the same until no more green in color right Then allow to settle down. After multiple ranges of hot distilled water, now the water is clear and that is our washing. Now we pour a stitch in the water. And leave it overnight. After soaking with the chino tree, I have only dissolved few amounts of metal here and maybe our remaining residue here is mostly silver chloride if there is gold and other metal okay boiling with our charcoal i see that uh, creating few amounts of fumes here After settle down, then they can the water here. That is our remaining residue. Maybe there's more silver chloride here, but there is gold also. So let's pour with hot distilled water here for washing. Then we're allowing to settle down a little bit. Then capturing our precipitation to our filter paper. Okay, that is our uh, material here so we are going to melt this one so let's take a look how much silver we got maybe silver just like that so it's what happened here Lots of slug here and this old unmelt silvery. <laughs> We left lots of black or possible. I don't know how much gold this one, but
I'm sure there's gold. Six point four, six point four grams. So thank you so much for watching, and we will refine this one. How much gold we got very soon? And this is all the copper that I recover. Maybe this is more than three kilogram. Yeah, very nice copper. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Need to dry.